Rishikesh Mukherjee was one of our most well-loved directors, probably best known for a series of gentle comedies and dramas that he did from the 1950s to the 1980s, all of which were about Indian middle class life. Now this scene is from one of his most low-key films, the 1977 Alap. And the context here is that Bachchan plays a man named Alok, who is the son of a rich man, uh, played by Om Prakash. They have a falling out and Alok ends up living in a basti with poor people, uh, practicing classical music which he is passionate about and also driving a tanga to earn his livelihood. And in this scene, you have a chance encounter between father and son after their parting of ways. लो अपनी मेहनत के पैसे रहने दीजिए आपका बहुत कर्ज है मुझ पर one of the things I find really interesting here is that this scene and the film in general provides a variant on the kinds of things that Amita Bachchan was doing in his more mainstream roles in his angry young man persona आह अच्छा ही हो क्यों क्या हुआ मुझे भाई ये भाभी कैसे अच्छे ही होंगे होंगे हाँ बहु मैं के चली गई अशोक ने भी वहीं वकालत शुरू कर दी कोई कह रहा था कि उसकी वकालत चमकी हुई है तो क्या आप यहाँ अकेले हैं नहीं अकेले क्यों चार नौकर हैं दो माली हैं एक ड्राइवर है और बाप दादा की इज्जत है here the tone is much more subdued and much more rooted in the conflicts that might face a small town middle class family and this is something in fact that Rishikesh Mukherjee did a lot in his other films with Amitabh Bachchan where he tended to cast Amitabh in such a way that he used the actor's strengths in comedy and drama but also gave him more understated context to perform in. Something else I find interesting which if you look at that scene you'll see that Right at the start, uh, the Om Prakash character, when he climbs onto the tanga, he doesn't even realize that this is his son driving it. And the reason for that is that he never looks at the tangawala's face. Why would he? He's a privileged Makan Malik. For him, this man isn't really a human being who needs to be engaged with by, uh, at the level of eye contact. He's someone who's providing a menial service. And this, again, is something that you find variants of in a lot of Rishikesh Mukherjee's work, this commentary on the class divide and how a certain sort of privileged person might behave in a certain situation. Even in lighter contexts, in Chupke Chupke, for instance, you have uh, this famous scene where Dharmendra playing a professor, but dressed in a chauffeur's uniform, as you can see here, uh, goes to his childhood friend's office, and the friend, played by Srani, looks up, for a split second, clearly doesn't look at his face, but just registers that there is a driver in the driver's uniform. Mein koi aaya hai. And it takes a couple of minutes before he even realizes that this is his friend in the room. And you have that sort of thing happening in many of these other films. Golmal has something like that as well. So do other films where you see the importance of appearances and the importance of external things like what you're wearing and how the, how the real person sometimes gets lost as a result.